Today is officially the last day of the 2020 Atlantic hurricane season. And like other 2020 calamities, we are not sorry to see it come to an end. Here's a look at this record-breaking storm season by the numbers. 30 named storms developed in the Atlantic Basin, the most in any year in recorded history. 13 of these storms became hurricanes, and six became major hurricanes with winds of 111 miles per hour or greater. That's twice the typical number. Louisiana was hit especially hard, where five named storms Storms made landfall a record for any American state. This season surpassed the previous record of 28 named storms in 2005, which included Hurricane Katrina. And for only the second time in history, we ran out of Roman alphabet names and had to use the Greek alphabet, starting, of course, with Alpha. The latest hurricane, Iota, is the ninth Greek lettered storm. It unleashed 160 mile per hour winds over the Caribbean Sea before battering Nicaragua. And while the hurricane season is officially ending more storms could still develop before the 2021 hurricane season officially begins on June 1st. Still lots to get to here on Prime. The Supreme Court hearing President Trump wants undocumented immigrants to be excluded to the maximum extent from the census in the future. If the justices agree, that could have major political impacts. We'll explain. The new series exploring black markets around the globe. And where is that monolith now? Apparently, it's missing again. But first, to look at our top trending stories on abcnews.com. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.